I know you guys have not seen me yet. I look crazy until later today. So I'm not even going to show myself. But one of my first few gifts already coming in for my birthday, which is not until March. But my mom is early. I don't mind. So let's get into this. Super cute box. She put it in a gift box because she's extra. Love her for it. Um, ooh. all right, so we got our dealer's receipts. I'm not sure what this is. Card, oh, my mom saying happy birthday. <laughs> all right, and then we got our girl here, Bug. I've been wanting this bag, and I told her. I really want this bag and she got it for me so I'm gonna take it out of the plastic I just broke my nail trying to open this and record so like trying to pick up the box but this is it and she is cute so this is her all out too cute and then, boom. I think this will fit everything I need. I didn't get the really big one because I just didn't really want a really big bag since it's going to be my work bag. But I think I'm definitely going to get some gibbets to put on it. And she's cute. She's doing it for me. Good luck inside your heart. Is there any room for me? I won't have to hold my breath till you get down on one knee Because you only want to hold me when I'm looking good enough Did you ever fool me? Would you ever picture us? Every time I pull my hair up, there's any out of fear But you'll find me ugly and one day you'll disappear Cause what's the point of cracking it? I know, I know, I know. I'm opening the vlog, which is great. But you guys have already seen like a bunch of stuff that we've already done over the past few days. And today is February 13th. So there's a little bit of a gap between this vlog and my last vlog, which was actually in January. Yeah, it was at the end of January though. So not that long, but it's been like two weeks. It just took me a while to edit it with my work schedule and all that extra stuff, but today's the day before Valentine's Day, and I work tomorrow night on Valentine's Day night. And my husband works Valentine's Day day, and he works today. But you know, when you work eight hours, you have every night. So yeah, we are celebrating tonight. So we're gonna go to dinner, as far as I know, uh, to this place called Black Rock. It's a really cool place. They give you like you cook your steaks and things on these black rocks and then like they give you serve you your sides and whatever. Okay, y'all. Uh, I'm back. Um I'm also trying to like export the last vlog that you guys by this point should have already seen. Um, so that I can upload it today, February 13th. But my husband keeps calling me about our Colorado trip next week. And y'all know how husbands do. Like they just can't make decisions. Um, <laughs> but that's okay. All right. So I'm going to do my eyebrows and eyelashes as I said. I don't know if I'm wearing my current wig, which is like this natural looking like half wig. Really see, but it basically looks like I've got part right here, push my hair back, which this is my hair pushed back, and then I have like my kinky 
curly wig on. And I'm trying to decide if I want to wear it like this, if I'm going to wear it as a V part, or if I'm just going to like wear it as a side bar, maybe. I don't know. Or wear a whole different wig all together. I don't know. All right. So, what I am using, which I do not recommend, is shaving cream to get the extra off my eyebrows. And this will just lay my eyebrows just enough to where the extra hair is easy to get off. I'm using the eyebrow razor, which, you know, a lot of awesome. It works for me, but I'm not going to recommend it for everybody. But, yeah. So, this is what we're going to do. extra on my hands all right so now i'm just gonna clean it up i'm back my eyebrows are done as you can see they're not as bushy at all um but my camera died so i couldn't even really like show y'all show y'all which is probably a good thing because i cut my lash not my lash my eyebrow on this side it low-key hurts it but now I'm going to do my eyelashes. So all I do is I take some strip lashes. I cut them into clusters pretty much. And then I am going to glue them with like eyelash glue. Not sure like lash adhesive. Like the the one that you use for like individual type lashes. Um, so I'm going to use that. Mine is from Kiss. I'm sorry my baby's lit. And his play band. But yeah I'm going to use that. And... Hopefully it turns out good because these are like my little, I don't even know what you call these. Like these are like scrap lashes. So I have some from like an old AliExpress pack that I got like three years ago. And then I have some from Nice that are kind of like longer. So I'm going to kind of like alternate them so I get that like, you know, more natural kind of look. And I have my little spoolie spoolie on my eyelashes. My eyelashes are clean because I've already washed my face and all that good stuff. So I'm just going to cut these up so that um, I can use them. So I cannot be touched. Okay, y'all. I gotta hurry up because my baby's crying. But this is the finished look. Tell me how y'all like it. I think I did pretty good. Um, I definitely like this eye better than this eye. But that's usually how it always is. My second eye is better than my first eye. But I really like this one. So, yeah. Oh, oh, good. So we're in Ross. Let's see what we can find in here. It looks like it might be some good stuff, so I am excited. I think this is super cute. What y'all think? So many good canvases for $25. This is why you don't let me go shopping, because I don't even know if I can carry all of this out of the store. This is all the stuff I got. Like, why was I let to go in Ross with a slightly high budget? Slightly high, you know. And I damn near bought the whole store. Girl.